Hello, in this video, I'm going to show you guys another common error message and what might be the cause of it. So let me first go through the code that I have here. I have an IP outlet, which is an image view, and it's called my image view. So this property or this outlet is connected to a UI image view element in my storyboard. If you've gone through my first 15 beginner lessons, uh, on my YouTube page, you'll know that um, you know you can add elements onto your storyboard, like I have here, a UI image view that's used to display an image, and you can connect them to uh, the code file or the Swift file, and then you can uh, use code to set the properties of it. So what am I doing here? This is the second line that I want to show you guys. I'm referencing that image view, and it has an image property and I'm setting that image property to a new UI image object and I'm just setting uh, some random name of an image that doesn't exist but that's irrelevant so what I'm trying to do here with this line is set the image of the image view so that I can display some sort of image and when I run this I get an error in the console window here if you don't have this console window uh, make sure you have this lower button here highlighted so it shows it if you don't see this area at all down here click this icon here to reveal that pane okay so the error message is unrecognized selector sent to instance something uh, and selector is another name for method or function so what it's saying is that it doesn't recognize the function that you're trying to call on this object to put it in plain words and it tells you right here that you're trying to call the set image method here uh, of an object that is a UI button well that's really strange because I could have sworn that my property is a type of UI image view and I know for a fact that UI image view has a method called um, set image or it, when you set the image property it's actually behind the scenes it's calling the set image method so that's why um, it's telling you that it has this error well this error message says that you're trying to set you're trying to call this set image method on a button so that tells you that maybe the element that is connected to this property even though we think it is a UI image view is not actually and I see this happen a lot because in the storyboard, you may have elements overlapping each other and it's kind of hard to tell. So when you are connecting your IB outlets, when you're connecting these elements to the Swift file, so I'm gonna click the assistant editor button here. It shows you side by side um, so that you can click and drag and connect your elements to the right hand side to the code file here. So what must have happened is I must have accidentally highlighted the button and held down control and dragged it over here and connected my button but I named it the image view thinking that I was dragging the image view so that's where the error is in fact if I right click the button you can see down here in referencing outlets that this button is connected to the my image view property of this view controller so I just want to click the X and break that connection. So you can see here now that uh, this gray dot is uh, empty. It's an empty circle, meaning that this property is no longer connected or this outlet's no longer connected. So one surefire way of connecting outlets is instead to use this document outline. Um, and you can select the element from this listing and then hold down control and drag it all the way here and then create your outlet that way. So if you don't see this document outline in your storyboard, there's a button down here. You can hide it and show it like that. So now that we've already written this outlet, what if I don't want to create a new one? Because right now it's not connected to anything, right? There's an empty gray circle. So what I can do is I can right click or command plus click, if you have one button mouse, the image view. And then down here in referencing outlets, go here to this circle drag 
you don't have to hold down control you just click and drag it drag it to the view controller up here let go and you can see here that you can connect it to the my image view property so I'm going to do that now you can see that under referencing outlets this image view element is connected to the my image view property like that and now on this side you can see that um, this circle is highlighted in gray a solid gray meaning that it's connected so now my app won't crash because it's going to call let me just run it it's going to call set image on a UI image view element which is what we expected but unfortunately you also won't see any image because I don't actually have an image called my image name but you can see that there's no crash now so if you see an error message in your console that says something like unrecognized selector sent to instance something, dig around in the console to find out what element is actually connected to that property. In my case, I was trying to call uh, the set image method on a button. And in the console area, I could see that that outlet was connected to a button rather than a UI image element as I was expecting it to be. So I hope that saves you guys some time in debugging your own apps and I'll see you guys next time.